Welcome back to Star Sector, folks. We are down here. We just dealt with a, a Lodic Path base. And we now have... Um, where are colony threats there? We have a society raid coming in 43 days, which will arrive here. And it says that uh, the colonies are at risk. So... That's not so good, but there's 43 days to go until they arrive, and hmm. So there, there is a bounty that I would like to try and do, I think, which is this one with two paragons, an astral and some dooms. I think I want to go try do that. Yeah. Uh, we're going to want a trinary star system. Okay, so that's here. So let's let's do that. Let's just transfer jump out of here. Heart rate failed. Stroma. I have a bunch of Star Fortress is being built. You can see our money has gone down somewhere. We just got 1.8 million income, but before that, our our finances had uh, taken a hit. But that was because I built a crap ton of uh, Star Fortresses or started them building at least. So yeah, but let's uh, head up here. It'll take a while. Get there. We should be able to make it. Orbital works. TARDIS is completed. Nice. Okay. Let's see. Uh, TARDIS. Because you have fuel production as well. We already have the pristine nano forge. We do have, I can't do that from afar, but we do have a synchrotron core there ready to install. So that's not half bad. Okay. Let's get up there. I want to go through the cloud if I can help it. One day. All right, here we go. Let's jump in here. Uh, actually, let's save. I want to get one of those paragons, if I can, because I've never had one, and I want one. Baron world. There's a barren world there. And that's the only one, so I guess he's up here. Alright. Let's fight. Two Paragons, an Astral, four Dooms, an Eos, a Heron, a Revenant. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Some Harbinger, Harbingers, a Vortex, some Afflictors, Insurgents, which I don't think I've ever seen before either. Some Shades, a Centurion, a Rockhound, and some Fighters. Alright. Agile. Blockade Runner, Durable, Unstable Shields, Cursed, Reliable Missile Forge, Stable Hard Points, Efficient Flock Vents. Uh, uh, not a chance. Uh, move in to engage. Continue. Let's see, we'll send in me. We'll send in at least the Robber Velvet Claw and their Cirrus Vala. I think we'll send in two of you as well. And that leaves us with 40. Well, 50. 
Hmm. An onslaught. An onslaught. Okay, we have two sensor jammers down here, which is kind of nice. I want to take both of those. So let's just say to everyone go over here. You support that. You support that. You support me. And go. And I will, instead of going up to the top one, I'll go to the bottom one real quick and take that. Get out of my way, dude. Chaos. All right. Let's do this. Let's speed up. Where is it? It's over there. Heading in the right direction. Two sensor jammers will be nice. Alright, we're taking that. It's ours. We've taken that. Okay. We have incoming. Um, let's have a look. Uh, Doom, I think it is. Yeah. I don't see whatever that was over there anymore. Two Paragons. That scares me a bit, but it'll be a fun fight. It'll be a fun fight. Let's, uh, let's give some orders here. So you hang out there. You hang out over here. I want our... Onslaught to kind of be the holding center. Oh, we destroyed a rock hound. Woo! There's a paragon. I'll be on this side of... Hmm. This is gonna be a tough fight, guys. Put a strike on you. Shade disabled. I really want to get one of those paragons if I can. For myself. Cells get pulled out of position. There's a shade down. Speed. 
speed up a bit. The Harbinger destroyed, Centurion disabled. So we're kind of taking out all the support ships. Which is fine. Like that, shade destroyed. Harbinger destroyed. Okay. Let's take out these little guys. If we can. They're kind of annoying. Doom destroyed, nice. Okay. All those little buggers are really annoying. The Paragon has actually taken quite a bit of damage. Which is nice. Vortex destroyed, insurgent destroyed. You know what? Let's tell you to attack that. Tell you to attack that. Put strikes on two of these. They're annoying. That doom is gonna go down. Oh, Revenant. That was the Revenant. There's a doom. Afflicted disabled. I guess that's one of the ones that had a strike on it. Right, that Paragon is taking some damage, which is really nice. That is good to see. Taking our afflictor down. They're taking our damned points here. We haven't taken them yet, but you attack that. You attack that. Bugger. Flicker disabled. Speed up. Surgeon disabled. Doom destroyed. Let's put a strike on this doom as well. You attack that. I'll 
attack the EOS as well. That's something that I can actually hit. My slow moving weapons. EOS down. Attack that. Check out the astral. Oh, here comes the other paragon. Alright, astral down, let's vent. You attack that. Go help with the Paragon. Monsters Bella has taken a little bit of all damage, but it's very over close to overloading. Doom destroyed. Attack that. We need to vent. Let's put a strike on you as well. Right, it's gonna have to put shields down. We're doing damage. We're doing damage. So as well as out of missiles. Vent, vent, vent before it turns. Alright, it's going down. There we go. Paragon disabled. We have defeated them. Let's claim victory. So there's Vala took a little bit of hull damage, but that was it. And there's one Doom left. Let's pursue it. Good view. All right, consider ship recovery. Yes, a paragon. We are definitely recovering that. Structural damage, erratic fuel injector, but we will just fix it. Recover, pick through the wreckage, take everything. Beautiful, we got a paragon, guys. Oh, the Alpha Core I have here, I stole from uh, the Megaport in uh, on Odin. Nice! Nice! Harbinger, no. I might actually make a Doom. All right, let's head down to Alpha Dnieper. Are we under crude now? No, no. All right, we got a paragon. Yes. I'll be trying flying that for a bit. That's for dang sure. But I will probably switch back to the Panda because I love the Panda. That is a great ship. All right, Odin. Storage. Whole lot of weapons. We do have the Doom blueprint, so I think I'll ask my colonies to build us a Doom or two. 
Just for funsies. Alright. Well, let's actually do that now. Where's the doom? Doom. Let's build two. Just for fundies, funsies. Right. Um, why do I have two ordnance points left on this? I switched some of the weapons, that's why. Um, I took off, I, I had a comment suggesting that I take took off the lazy horns that I, I had on here. So I switched them with uh, dual microfission suits and two Clements pulsimeters. So we'll see what that does. Still, uh, still, uh, what are they called? Point defense. Still point defense. 864,000 to restore it. We'll do that. So we have stabilized shield, hardened shield, resistant flux, conduit, flux distributor, and accelerated shields. That's a lot. Whoa. Uh, and it has an advanced targeting, targeting core. Okay. Not bad. We will give you augmented drive field. We don't need extended shields. What we could do is... Hmm, what's extreme modifications? Okay. Hmm. Doesn't increase the amount of ordnance points available. Not that I see. Oh, it does. 150. So why not? I like that. And it didn't do anything bad. So, why the hell not? Uh, hmm. Let's do shield conversion front. Because... That... So, locks the ship's omnidirectional shield emitter to a front-facing position and extends its arc by 100%. We don't need the extended arc, it also already has 360 degrees. In addition, the stable emitter, emitter position results in a 50% reduction to the shield's upkeep cost. And, as well as with all frontal emitters, the shield will also deploy twice as quickly. So, I think that's well worth it. Uh, operations center... No. Maybe the ECM package? Let's try that. Now, the rest of the refit of this ship is gonna have to be done in the next one, guys, because we are basically out of time. So we will do that. I'll take these tactical lasers off. Take that off. Take those off. Anything else here? Yeah. All right. So it's completely stripped now. Which is good. That is exactly what I wanted. And next time we'll have a bit of fun uh, refitting this guy. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.